Yes, and you said key third down. I like that word, put it in bold. Here we go. An important play right here, third and ten. And I would expect pressure here. Here's Locke to throw. And he's going to get this down near the 30-yard line. That one good for 13 and a Denver first down. And that pickup on the first down, that's going to leave a mark because they really needed to stop them there, didn't they? So frustrating defensively. You're a play away from getting that football back here down late. Tough. Now they've got to find a way to create a turnover or takeaway. Otherwise, this will probably get away from them. So first and 10 now from the 30. On the delayed handoff, this is good. Oh, no, he lost the football. But now this is scooped up by the 49ers. And they're going to set up shop at the 27 yard line. I know if you're looking at the scoreboard clock, we're, we're getting near the end of this game. But they bring what was really called four minute offense. And that's practice being taking care of the football, taking time off the clock, not giving them a chance to come back. But bottom line is, what did I say in the beginning? Taking care of the football. That didn't happen. Didn't do it. A costly turnover. And now, as with every potential turnover, they're going to take a second and look at this just to make sure. And the question, was the knee in fact down before this ball comes loose? And is the video convincing enough to overturn it? A lot of factors here. Remember, you also need clear possession of football afterwards. This is a tough one to overturn. successful one. They fumble on first down now. Here's second down. Lock going to hand it off here to Gordon. And he'll take it down here just shy of the 15 at the 16-yard line. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. No doubt those are the types of carries they're looking for here, Charles. The lead in the fourth quarter. This is when coaches that have a reliable running game, they breathe a little easier on the sidelines. Yeah, they love the idea that they can take the air out of the football at this point of the game. That means they're really counting on that offensive line, counting on the runners, taking care of the football. Because you've got to tell your quarterback, hey, no time to be a hero. We're not going to throw it here. Just eat up that clock. And if you have the ball, they can't score it. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. This is Gordon. He will push his way down to about the 14. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. Locked out of throw. And that'll be incomplete. Took a pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. Couldn't hang on. Third down. The Broncos on third down. They've converted three times and eight chances. This is third and eight. And they're going to drop it well shy of the first as he can only make it to the 11. Call it a gain of three and it'll bring up fourth down. And he continues to pile up the yardage. That puts him over a buck 50 now. And this defense has really had his problems trying to keep him contained. perspective though I think maybe they're saying hey we did what we needed to do kept us a one score game yeah without a doubt because they were able to bleed some time off the clock right put themselves in a good position but it's not out of reach yet and being able to hold them to a field goal means that they do have a chance to come back and win this game San Francisco set to go on offense once more. And for them, a touchdown their last go around. Obviously, they'll be hoping to do that again. And when you start plotting for this drive, when you start thinking to yourself, okay, what are we going to do? You don't go away from what you did before because that worked. 
but you have to be prepared for wrinkles and counters because you know they'll make some adjustments. Garoppolo on first down. Oh, this one incomplete. The pressure got to him as he released it. And it's second down. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage right there. There weren't really any throwing lanes, but the best part for him, he's got second and third down to fall back on. After the incompletion on first, now second and ten. A shotgun snap for Garoppolo. He'll fire this deep for Ayuk. And he knocks the ball away and it falls incomplete. Brandon Ayuk, the one he was looking for. Third down here. This defense was definitely alert to the possibility of the deep ball, and they were more than ready for it. They got the lead, fourth quarter. Maybe can expect more passes like that downfield. From the gun on third, Garoppolo winds up and lets it go for Samuel. And this is dropped. Oh, it's incomplete. He had a big gainer in his sights, but he could not reel it in. Here comes the 49ers punter now, as he'll punt it away for the fourth time today. Escapes the defender. A pretty good punt, but a nice 13-yard return. And coming out now, the Broncos. They have the lead, obviously, late in the game. I guess the good news for them is if for some reason they would make a mistake, a field goal does the opposition no good. Everyone loves to have a little bit of a cushion, and that helps you immeasurably. But the bottom line is, do all the things that you're taught in order to close out the game. Don't even let that become an issue. Yeah, but it's still a one-possession game. This one not fully over yet. They give him four yards there. It'll be second and six. Looking to throw. Block. He's going to float this one deep right side. Oh, wide open. Complete. And all the way home for a Bronco score. Tim Patrick, 55 yards. And the Broncos use the big play to extend their fourth quarter lead. And correct me if I'm wrong, that was just a simple fly route, wasn't it? No, there's nothing to correct at all. You've got it down pat. And I just remember as a player, when I'd be in practice sessions and I'd hear nine from the receivers, that meant fly route, go, uh-oh, look out. That was the nine, and he just kept going all for the touchdown. The point after threw the raindrops up and good. And the lead now up to 14. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. Here's James. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. The San Francisco's offense returns to the field. These guys had to punt their last possession, and that's become too familiar of a refrain. Too many of these drives just wound up going nowhere. But you know how in baseball, when the pitcher gets a base hit and he's on base, they bring his jacket out to him to 